Hello everyone, this is TVC News at 10. Getting the best constitution for Nigeria is the task at hand as a two-day public hearing to amend the 1999 constitution begins across zones in the country. Devolution of power, fiscal federalism, gender equality, electoral reforms, among others, topped the agenda during the simultaneous meetings. Here in Lagos, the Senate Committee on Constitution Review advocated a bottom-up approach in deliberations. Host Governor Babati Desanwolu used the opportunity to appeal that Lagos be accorded a special status. Correspondent Adi Doja Salama Deni has details. Members of the Nigeria Union of Local Government Employees and labor unions welcoming guests to the Constitution Review Zona public hearing. On the display was the myriads of issues they want to be addressed to make the country better. Ladies and gentlemen, it's a complete house of all the senators representing Lagos, Ogun, and Oyo. Lagos Central Senator Olure Mitinumbu is representing the Deputy President of the Senate and Chairman Senate Committee on the Constitution Review, Ovi Omagege. She says the public hearing is needed to be bottom-up approach by first listening to the people. I wish to assure you most sincerely that the memoranda you have already submitted and those that may come forward arising from this hearing and all the deliberations and engagements that will come forth from them will not only enjoy critical consideration by this committee, but they will be the lodestar of our work as a committee. With Lagos on his mind, Governor Sonwolu tabled what he believes are areas of concern. The issue of state police and fiscal federalism are top of the priority list for us. In this ongoing review process, equally fundamental, particularly for us in Lagos, is the issue around the special economic status for Lagos. Considering our place in national economy and the special burden we bear by virtue of our large population and the very limited landmass that we have. Well before the day of independence, all workers employed by federal government and all regions will be paid five pound minimum wage. This was the argument that made Shagari in 1981 to prescribe a national minimum wage of 125 Naira, which today is more than $100. Representatives from Ogun and Oyo also discussed issues they want amended. We, the people of Ibarra land and our kinsmen of Ibarra area of the present or your state presented a memorandum under the aegis of the Central Council of Ibadan Indigenous and the Barapa Forum to the Senate and the House of Representatives at Abuja for creation of Ibadan State out of the present or your state. The 1999 constitution has been said not to be people oriented and forced by the military on Nigerians. They believe that at the end of this public hearing, the process will bring forth a semblance of a people's constitution to assuage the agitations of many in the country. Adedoja Salamadini, TVC News, Lagos.